Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn class 8, chapter 2, linear equations in one variable, exercise 2.5. See now, solve the following linear equations. First sum, x by 2 minus 1 by 5, that equals to x by 3 plus 1 by 4. Here, plus x by 3 on transposing it becomes minus x by 3. And minus 1 by 5 on transposing it becomes plus 1 by 5. So that implies x by 2 minus x by 3 that equals to plus 1 by 5 plus 1 by 4. These two denominators we are going to do LCM. Here also these both numbers we have to do LCM. For 2 and 3 LCM is 6 and 5 and 4 LCM is 20. So we have to write the LCM value in the denominator. Now let us take numerator part, cross multiply 3 into x, 3x minus 2 into x, 2x. That equals to, here also cross multiply, 4 into 1, 4 plus 5 into 1, 5. That implies 3x minus 2x, that is x by 6. That equals to, 4 plus 5, 9 by 20. That implies x equal to, here 6 is dividing, on transposing it becomes multiply. So x equal to 9 into 6 by 20. 2 table, 3 times 6, 10 times 20. Now multiply numerator 9, 3 is at 27 by denominator 10. Therefore, x value is 27 by 10. See now question number 2. n by 2 minus 3n by 4 plus 5n by 6 that equals to 21. Now we have to do LCM for the denominators 2, 4 and 6. 2 table, 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4, 2 3s are 6. Again, 2 table, 2 1s are 2, 3 random as it is. Now, take 3 table, 3 1s are 3. So, LCM is 2 into 2 into 3. That is, 2 2s are 4, 4 3s are 12. Therefore, LCM value is 12. So, we have written here LCM value 12 in the denominator. Now, let us take numerator part. Write down numerator n into 2 table 12 is 6 times. So, n into 6 minus write down 3n into 4 table 12 is 3 times. So, into 3. Plus, write on numerator 5n into 6 table 12 is 2 times. That equals to 21. That implies n into 6, that is 6n minus 3n into 3, that is 9n plus 5n into 2, that is 10n by 12, that equals to 21. That implies 10n minus 9n, that is n. 6n plus n, that is 7n, that equals to 21 into here 12 is dividing on transposing it becomes multiply. So 7n equal to 21 into 12. That implies 7n equal to 21 into 12 that is 252. Now we have to find the n value. So n equals to 252 by 7. 7 table 7 ones are 7. 7 table 36 times 252. Therefore n value equals to 36. See now question number 3, x plus 7 minus 8x by 3, that equals to 17 by 6 minus 5x by 2. That implies here minus 5x by 2 on transposing it becomes plus 5x by 2. Here plus 7 on transposing it becomes minus 7. So we have written x minus 8x by 3 plus 5x by 2. That equals to 17 by 6 plus 7. Here it became minus 7. Now we have to do LCM for the denominators. Here 3 and 2 LCM is 6. So we have written 6 in the denominator. Now let us take numerator part x into. Here denominator no value that is 1 is present. So 1 table 6 is 6 times. So x into 6 minus 8x into 3 table 6 is 2 times. Plus numerator 5x into 2 table 6 is 3 times. So we have written x into 6 minus 8x into 2 plus 5x into 3 by 6. That equals to here 7 below no number is there. That means it have denominator 1. So we have written here 1. For 6 and 1 LCM is 6. Now we have to do cross multiply 17 into 1. 17 minus 6 into 7 that is 42. So 17 minus 42 by 6. Next that implies x into 6. 6x minus 8x into 2 that is 16x plus 5x into 3 that is 15x by 6. 
that equals to 17 minus 42 that is minus 25 by 6. Here on both sides we shall cancel 6. Now that implies minus 16x plus 15x we will get minus x. 6x minus x that is 5x that equals to here minus 25. Now we need to find x value. So x equal to minus 25 by 5. 5 table 5 ones are 5. 5 table 5 times 25. Here minus is there. So x value is minus 5. Hope you all like this video. If you like this video please like, share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.